Good morning, everybody. I am up and at it this morning. We got up at, Sienna, what time did you get up? She got up before 6 a.m. I'm not really sure what time she got up, but I didn't get up until 6 or 5. And then I came downstairs and made myself a cup of coffee, drank that. She made an egg in the middle for breakfast. And now we're just packing her lunch and doing mom mom duties. But I wanted to say good morning to you all before it got too late. It's 7 or 6 now. I'm making Cody a coffee because he should be home from the gym soon. And then we can really get our day started. I also need to make a I need to make mac and cheese and put it in a thermos for CNS. Breakfast. Good morning. We have the mac and cheese cooking in the microwave. So we'll put that in the thermos when we're done. I am using Cody, an egg in the middle. Sienna's already had her, she made her own. And then I'm making the younger kids French toast sticks in the oven. We should be up soon. But these don't take very long. The oven's already preheated to 450. So that's good. But that is one of the It's already I'm feeling I need to get the um, dishwasher going, the laundry going. And then we'll have a really productive day. Today after school, my dad and mom, well, I don't know if they both are or one or the other, are picking up Sienna and Skylar from school. So that's awesome. And then I only have to leave really once today at 11 to take Skylar to school. But yeah, it's going to be a pretty productive day, I feel like. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Although when I say that, then I like usually sit on the couch watching YouTube and that doesn't that doesn't help anything. All right, I'm gonna make this. I'll show you it when it's done. All right, this is done. This thermos is actually pretty good and we'll keep it hot. It's been a while since I've put anything, put this on, anything hot in Sienna's lunch, actually. Um, if you're wondering what she's having, she's got a sugar-free Jello, a thing of Pringles, some pretzels with a thing of hummus, and then a bag of fruit. So that will be her lunch today. Let me put in a couple of spoons. And then she will be good to go. Yeah, great, great vlogging, Erica. All right. It is me. I am back. It is 9.41. Still in my pajamas. Still haven't gotten ready for the day. But I quickly need to put dinner in the crock pots. I'm going to have two crock pots going tonight, which is pretty unusual. I don't think I've ever made dinner that required two crock pots. But what I'm going to make is in one, a meatloaf, which again, I have never done before. And two, roasted red potatoes and carrots, which again, I've never done before so wish me luck i also pulled a recipe off the internet that i've never done before so that should be interesting but i'll quickly show you what i'm about to use and i apologize for the background noise my kids are watching spider-man so hopefully the music doesn't interfere with youtube law and regulation okay what it calls for is a package of herb season classic stuffing. I'm only using 12 ounces, so I'm going to take just a little bit out of here. A thing of chopped onions, two pounds of ground beef. It was cheaper for me to buy a three pound log of this. So that's what I bought. The recipe, which I, if I remember, I'll link below, said to get about an 80 20. And I believe, yep, this is 80 20. So that, some milk two eggs and then some salt and some pepper and then for the glaze i am just doing my classic glaze theirs called for a couple more ingredients but i am just a you know ketchup mustard and brown sugar gal so this will all make that up then we'll make the glaze that goes on top it did call for me to line my crock pot with foil so we will do that and then next we will make just the carrots and 
red potatoes, which I'm gonna just put some seasoning and probably butter, and that's about it. Yeah, so I have both crock pots going. And here, I have the meatloaf with the glaze on top, and here I just have carrots and red potatoes. So that makes me really happy that dinner is cooking. Hopefully this works out. If it does, this will be the perfect for like a big family gathering because it's two pounds of ground beef. I mean, it's a big, big, big meatloaf. I'm just hoping that it cooks all the way through. Okay, we will see, I guess, later on. Again, I don't even know if my kids, because my parents are picking them up tonight. I have no idea if they even are having dinner. If not, we will just have this for leftovers. Um, either tomorrow night or the night after. I don't know, we got a lot of food here. All right, we're gonna carry on our day. It's 10 or six. I'm gonna get jet dressed and ready and get this little piece of cheese out of here. We are now headed out to drop Skylar off at school <gasps> and then Jet and I, we're gonna stop at Payless. You know Payless is going out of business. Put on your seatbelt. So, we are gonna look. The, Payless is the only place that carries the champion shoes that Jet really likes. They like fit all of my kids' feet really well, so it's kind of, why did I go blurry? It's kind of sad because oh, no. that was like, okay, hold on, let me start the car. That was like my go-to place to get shoes because my kids like them, and they're cheap. They don't last very long, but. We'll go and look and see what they have. I'm stuck at the door. Bye. Have a good day, too. Bye. Bye. Hi, Skylar. Jed and I, he's outside of his seatbelt, are here at Payless. We are going to go inside and see if we can find him the same shoes as those. And then those will become his softball shoes. Because these champion shoes are his favorite, aren't they? They're the most comfortable. All right, let's go inside. Are you saving that chip for later? <laughs> yeah, they still have a lot of shoes, don't they? Let's try to find yours. We're out of Payless. We've got a little haul for you. We were walking around looking at sandals and we found these adorable neck pillows. We got Sienna the rainbow, and we got Skylar the unicorn, and we got Jet the puppy. And these will be perfect for when we drive to Florida my kids can sleep. I almost got myself one. Look, I actually got the puppy. They had ones that weren't, you know, kid oriented, even though I would love to sleep on a rainbow. Um, yeah, but they're not like, they're not like, they're too tight. Well, you don't, you unbutton it. Um, See? And you put it around you. And then you can sleep like that. And then your neck doesn't hurt. Uh, some other things that we got. I got a pair of flip flops. I got Sienna. Yeah. Yep, Sienna a pair of flip flops. Skylar a pair of llama flip flops. And Jet a pair of flip flops. I also got myself a pair of cat little slippers. I wear these around the house, so I needed mommy, a new one. Mommy, you can un you can clip it back and it won't hurt you. Yep, yeah, you can clip it or you can unclip it shoes that we bought. Jet, some cleats. He needs those for t-ball. Some new shoes. Get them while like I got them, these, right? Like these. Just like the ones that he has on that we got. I don't know, did I, was I vlogging that day? I can't remember. And then I just got Skylar a pair of gym shoes. I feel like with these two, they always run outside and play in their good gym shoes, so they always need a backup pair of gym shoes. Whereas Sienna, she's old enough that she knows not to go outside in her school shoes. She can switch them to her play shoes. And she typically does, so she's definitely better at that than the two younger. But I just think this is just great finds. Okay, let's go home. We have a couple hours. Can until... I wear this for the whole time? You can. We have a couple hours until um, I need to talk to my parents about making sure that they're picking the girls up from school and figure out what Jed is doing. 
I was gonna go to the car wash, but I do believe it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow, so we aren't, we're not even gonna deal with that. All right, let's go home. It is 2.30, we came home, we put all of that Payless shoe stuff in a basket awaiting vacation. We have honestly just been walking around, me and Jet. I took all the laundry upstairs, so all the laundry in the house is now really done. I mean, including Jet peed the bed, so all of his bedding, everything that he slept in, that is all washed and dried and upstairs. We just need to go through it and put it away. And then my kids, so bright, my kids, had put a bunch of stuffed animals in the bath with them. Not yesterday, but the day before. So I put all of those stuffed animals in the dryer and they're drying right now. So hopefully when that's all done, they can have nice um, dry stuffed animals to play with. All right, what is happening right now is my parents picked up, hopefully Jet, uh, hopefully Jet, hopefully Sienna and Skylar, hopefully they are in the car and they're about to come get Jet, and then I think they're gonna go have fun somewhere. If they send me any pictures, I'll insert them here. And then I have to go pick them back up around five, but I think they're just gonna have like an ice cream date. An after school midweek ice cream date is what I think the plan is. I have no idea. We're just gonna make them. But I wanted to update you. That is how my day is going. I will check in with you guys in a little bit. Can you hear them? Pisces. Nope, that's not them. <laughs> here he is. Where? Right here. Where? White truck. The white truck pulling in. Where is he? I don't see him. Where is he? Can you go on. I don't see him though. Bye. As you saw, my kids left. It is now 347. This meatloaf is smelling unbelievable. Like really good. I think it's, it, I'm fingers crossed, but it's really good. I, however, just finished doing all of the laundry. This is the first time where my house is clean, the dishes are done, the laundry is done, I have nothing pressing, nothing to do, my desk is pretty much clear, my entire house is put together, I have nothing. I did, however, you guys know how I told you I put these stuffed animals in the dryer. I ended up putting them in the washer. See, look, every room that you go in is just how it should be. I ended up putting them in, them in the washer and it's already done. Um, so we'll put those in the dryer because they smelled weird. It smelled like, how do I explain it? It smelled like bathtub and kind of mildewy. And now they smell wonderful. So we are going to put these guys in my dryer. Yeah, these were all in the bathtub. They all decided that they needed a bath. I also had a couple socks in there that I found. Oh, I can almost not reach. That I found around my house, so those will go inside. Get on in there, socks. That is what I'm doing though, just drying stuffed animals. That's how much laundry I don't have. I do have this basket that's for vacation. I've set everything that's vacation-y aside. We are in the car. It is, I can't see the time, but I think it's like 4.27 maybe. We are gonna stop at the tanning bed, but I went to yesterday. We're gonna go again today. I am not too terribly burnt or anything, but I'm not gonna go in a stand up. I think I'm gonna go into a different bed, but I'm gonna go for like eight minutes. Um, Blue was sad that I left. He is not used to not being into a routine of leaving midday. He's like in the routine of leaving at two to go pick up the girls. So I'm like, oh, poor thing. All right, we're gonna go to tanning bed, go in for like eight minutes, and then go pick my kids up and then come back home, eat dinner, jet his t-ball. I'm not sure if we will go, because I'm sure my kids, Skylar doesn't, she completed her homework, but I'm sure Sienna does. So I don't know if we'll go or not. We'll see what, what holds for later. Uh, but that is kind of how our evening's going, and then we will 
Ooh, come back home and get ready to go to bed, but I'm gonna go put my seatbelt on because safety first. Yeah, bye. Come on, we're leaving. You got T ball. Have fun. Bye. You got your bag? Highly recommend the meatloaf. I will leave the recipe down below. Fingers crossed that I remember. If I don't remember, leave it in the comments. I forgot. I am making Skylar a BLT. She did not want that. What? What are you what are you barking at? You want a BLT too? Do you want a BLT? Do you want to be out? Oh, did that scare you? It's just the toaster, bud. I am making her a BLT. I'm gonna go downstairs and get on my bicycle for a little bit and then wash this tanning bed. I use hot action lotion. I don't know if you guys know anything about that. But it, I don't really know exactly what it does. I think it brings the blood to the surface of the skin. It's supposed to make you tanner. I'm not really sure. Uh, I need to wash that off of my body because it's still on it. And then we're gonna wrap up the night, but I wanted to say good night. I'm sorry for the background TV noise. Skylar's over there watching TV. I'm gonna say goodnight before it gets too late. I'm gonna go ahead and edit and upload this video right when I'm done off of the bicycle so I can have a purely stress-free morning. I think I might even schedule it to go up at like 6.30, so. All right, I will see you all. I'm makeup everywhere. I'll see you all tomorrow.